Hey guys, it's Serena. Welcome back to my channel. Hope you guys have all been well. Today we're going to start a brand new series where I highlight the best products of a particular brand that I've tried. The series is called Best in Brand and today's episode is sponsored by YesStyle.com. So many of you guys living overseas have asked me where you can get all the Korean products I talk about on my channel. Well, YesStyle.com is one of the biggest global retailers for K-beauty products and fashion, and they've got a wide selection of products and brands, and they're very reasonably priced. Also, they give away free gifts and discounts every single day, so when you get the chance, be sure to check them out. So today I want to introduce you to a skincare brand that probably not many of you have heard of before and it's called Pyeong Kang Yul. Pyeong Kang Yul was created by the Pyongang Korean Medicine Hospital. They are a medical clinic that practices traditional Eastern medicine. Their main focus is on rhinitis, asthma, sort of anything related to the lungs, and also atopic dermatitis. So over their long history, they've developed a number of ways to treat skin problems, and that's how they created their own line of skincare products. So the philosophy behind the skincare line is all about minimal ingredients. They believe that they should only contain ingredients that are absolutely necessary for the skin. So their products don't contain harsh chemicals, fragrances, or dyes. Actually, a lot of their products don't even contain added water. So you can only imagine how concentrated the ingredients are. So a lot of skincare products you'll find will have a huge list of ingredients, some average to about 60, but this brand keeps to just 10 on average. Some products even contain a lot less. So you can see that they're all about minimal skincare and they are also cruelty free, which is amazing. And they've got a really good price point, especially considering the quality. So today I'm going to share with you my top five products from this line. So my first favorite product from the line is the Essence Toner. And I feel like a lot of people really, really love this toner. It only contains six ingredients, the first of which is astragalus root extract. Uh, astragalus root extract is a very common ingredient in traditional Eastern medicine. It has anti-inflammatory properties to it for skin, it's anti-aging, and it's supposed to help with healing wounds, which is great for those of you who are acne prone. Uh, what I love about this toner is the consistency of it. It's not too watery and it's not too thick, making it very versatile. So you can use it on a cotton pad and just wipe away all the residue left over after cleansing, or you can use it to just dab gently into your face as you would for the seven skin method. It's a, actually a really good choice for that. So yeah, overall, it's a really moisturizing toner. It's also very cooling. So it's great for those of you who have sort of irritated or sensitive skin. My next favorite product is the Mist Toner. This is a really great product personally for me for the summer months because I have dry dehydrated skin and I feel like just the moisture is not enough for uh, the drier and colder months here in Korea. Uh, but it is a great toner, especially if you have oily or combination skin. Um, this contains very little ingredients, the first of which is Coptis Japonica root extract. This particular extract is known for its uh, it's high antioxidants and it also has um, antibacterial and antifungal properties too, which makes it really ideal for, uh, for the summertime. Um, this particular root, I think, also gives off that cooling sensation, so it is quite refreshing when you use it. Uh, I think it's great if you want to sort of calm your skin down, if you have a lot of puffiness or swelling in the mornings. I get a lot of redness on my cheeks too and it really helps with that. The next favorite is the Nutrition Cream. Uh, this cream has a creamy, very dense texture to it, but it absorbs quite quickly. It has a lot of wonderful ingredients, including astragalus root extract, uh, macadamia seed oil, and shea butter. When you have dry skin, uh, shea butter is your friend. So I definitely feel that this product is meant more for those of you who have drier, sensitive skin types. I can use this product for all four seasons, but for the winter months, I do kind of 
boost it with a little bit more moisture by adding in the oil from Pyongang Yeol. Which leads me to my next favorite product, which is the oil. This is a lovely blend of carrier oils like jojoba, sunflower seed oil, and shea butter. And it has a few essential oils like lavender and citrus, which personally for me makes for a really nice uh, aromatherapy experience. Uh, but if you do get sensitive to essential oils, I would avoid using this. Also, because it contains citrus oils, you should try using it only at night because uh, citrus oils actually actually amplify sun exposure damage. Uh, so yeah, just be careful with that. Uh, the oil is not only very moisturizing, but it's also very light. So I find that it's great to just add a few drops of it into serums and creams and it just boosts hydration overall. And last but not least is the balancing gel. This is great for drier skin. If you have combination or oily, I highly recommend the Moisture Ample. It's an awesome product too, but this works really well for my skin. This should be the last step in your skincare routine at night. Think of it as a mask that you don't wash off. It's like a sealant that just seals in all the moisture that you've layered on your face. And the way you use this product will make or break your relationship with it. The texture is very honey-like and gooey, and it's actually kind of weird, but uh, the way you apply it will really make a difference. So the way I like to use it is just uh, put out a generous amount on my fingertips, put it on my skin, and then spread it ever so slightly, and then start dabbing it in, and then spreading it in that area. Now, if you just try to rub it in, it's going to separate and create sort of these little uh, bumps inside the product, so you have to make sure not to use it in that way. The best thing to do is just dab it in, and it will do wonders for your skin. Thank you so much for watching the first episode of Best in Brand where I covered five of my favorite Pyongyang Yeo products. All the products I mentioned today are available on the yesstyle.com website. I will leave links in the description box below. And as a bonus, YesStyle is offering you guys a 10% discount promo code for any orders over $49 until February 28th. So be sure to take advantage of that. For my next best in brand video, let me know which brand you want me to cover next. Leave me some suggestions. As always, thank you so much for watching. Stay happy, stay healthy, and I will see you in my next video. Bye for now. Annyeong!